What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another video. As you guys might know, if you guys watched this past WWE Raw, Kurt Angle in his hometown of Pittsburgh announced that he will be retiring and his retirement match will take place at this year's WrestleMania. Kurt Angle left WWE back in 2006 and jumped over to TNA and in a short amount of time, he helped raise TNA's weekly ratings. After 11 years since he left the WWE, he returned in 2017 to get inducted into the Hall of Fame. After being inducted into the Hall of Fame, the following Raw after WrestleMania, Vince McMahon announced that Kurt Angle was going to be the new Raw General Manager. In my opinion, he was an amazing Raw General Manager. He really did a great job and he did eventually return to in-ring and he had some really good matches. However, it's been the question for some time now of when he was going to retire from in-ring action and he recently announced that it was going to be at WrestleMania 35. Now there are two questions leading up to his retirement match. Number one, is he going to be having weekly matches on Raw leading up to his retirement match at WrestleMania? That one we will find out this coming Raw. If he does have a match, I assume he's going to continue having matches leading up to his WrestleMania match. And the second question is, who is Kurt Angle going to be facing at WrestleMania in his retirement match? So today I'm going to share my thoughts on who I think should face Kurt Angle in his retirement match at WrestleMania. Let's get right into this. So up first is a recent rival of Kurt Angle's and that is Drew McIntyre. For the last couple of months now, Drew McIntyre has been moving up on the rankings and I think it is amazing. Even though he is heel, I am a huge fan of him. By him having a match against Kurt Angle, a legend at WrestleMania and it being Kurt Angle's retirement match, not only could that help Drew McIntyre's career moving forward and having main event pictures and possibly title shots, but in my opinion, it'd be a very interesting farewell to Kurt Angle. In this match, if it were to take place, my prediction is that Kurt Angle would win, but because he is still a rival of Kurt Angle, I could see Drew McIntyre being the chosen one to face Kurt Angle at WrestleMania. Next up is the United States champion Samoa Joe. This one here, if it does happen, Samoa Joe versus Kurt Angle, it will be very interesting. On one hand, I could see Samoa Joe retaining the United States Championship if it is on the line. But in my opinion, whoever they choose to face Kurt Angle at WrestleMania, Kurt Angle should walk away the victor in this match just because Kurt Angle's career is amazing, it always has been, and the fact that he is having a retirement match is taking place at WrestleMania, in my opinion, he should definitely win that match because that is going to be the best farewell that Kurt Angle can get. So I could see if Kurt Angle does face Samoa Joe at WrestleMania, and it is for the United States Championship, it'd be very interesting to have Kurt Angle win the United States Championship and then have to vacate it on the following SmackDown. To me, having Kurt Angle win a championship in his retirement match going out as a champion would be an amazing thing for WWE to do. And I think it'd be very interesting for the fans as well to have the United States Championship be vacated and everybody on SmackDown get an opportunity for it. And I definitely would be excited to see if this match actually happens. Next up is AJ Styles. Ever since Kurt Angle returned, Kurt Angle for the most part has been part of Raw since he came back. He was the Raw general manager. And since the brand split back in 2016, AJ Styles has been exclusive to SmackDown only. So if they were to have a match, it would make sense to have them have a match at WrestleMania and be Kurt Angle's farewell retirement match. These two had an amazing rivalry in TNA and I think it'd be very interesting to have it happen in WWE. And this would also be the first time that they ever face each other inside the WWE ring. And it honestly would be exciting to see if it actually were to happen. If this match happens, in my opinion, I think Kurt Angle should definitely win it because going against AJ Styles, AJ Styles has proven himself in the WWE in a short amount of time. Having him have a WrestleMania match against Kurt Angle is amazing on its own, but I think that Kurt Angle should deserve the win, if anything. The next opponent, in my opinion, is what I'm going to call a dream opponent for Kurt Angle for his retirement match, and that is going to be against Undertaker. This would be an ideal match because 
it is something that Undertaker has done for the past however many years now. He has had two losses at WrestleMania. So if he did face Kurt Angle and Kurt Angle did win, it wouldn't affect Undertaker's streak because his streak is no longer. Kurt Angle and The Undertaker did have a rivalry back in the day in the WWE, but it'd be nice to have a farewell match against Kurt Angle. The only reason why I'm going to say this is a dream match only, and I don't see it actually taking place, is because Undertaker has not yet been announced for WrestleMania. It would make sense to have him face Kurt Angle at WrestleMania, but... By now, in my opinion, I think Undertaker having a match at WrestleMania would have been announced. So since that has not happened, I just don't see Undertaker having a match at this year's WrestleMania. And the last person that I would like to see face Kurt Angle at this year's WrestleMania in his farewell retirement match is John Cena. Back whenever John Cena debuted, he faced Kurt Angle in his first ever match. So in my opinion, it would make complete sense to have the two face off in Kurt Angle's retirement match. This match here would definitely be interesting to see and if it does happen and it is announced within the next couple weeks, I would definitely be a fan of it and I think it would hype up WrestleMania even more. So I definitely can't wait to see who is announced, but out of these five that I just shared with you that are possibilities right now, Honestly, I would say John Cena would be right up there. He'd be the one that I would choose if I was given the opportunity to choose who faced Kurt Angle at WrestleMania in his retirement match. Kurt Angle versus John Cena to me just makes complete sense. John Cena beat Kurt Angle in his debut match. So to have Kurt Angle beat John Cena in Kurt Angle's retirement match would be honestly amazing to see. These are my predictions on who Kurt Angle is going to be facing at WrestleMania. Comment down below who you think will be chosen to face Kurt Angle at WrestleMania. Do you think anybody that I said in this list is going to be the chosen one? Or do you think it's going to be somebody else that's in WWE? Comment down below. I want to hear what you guys think. I am going to leave this video here. I hope you guys did enjoy. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.